was the first chord that we learned with one finger. That was the ring finger in the third fret down on the first string. The next one finger chord is going to use finger number two, which is the middle finger. We're going to jump up to the fourth string, which is the one closest to your face, and we are going to play that in the second fret. Finger number two, string number four, fret number two. Once you have mastered the C chord and the A minor chord, you can practice strumming and changing in between them. This is also the reason why I'm very picky with people playing the C chord with the ring finger because some say, well, it's quite comfortable to play with my middle finger. It makes the switch to A minor quite tricky. So C with the ring finger, A minor with middle, and then we're able to move our fingers back and forth. So once you have the C chord and the A minor chord, we'll practice doing eight strums on C, switch to A minor, and we'll do that a few times. One, two, start on C, and one, two, three, four. Switch to A minor, 